Okay, so this is where they make angels. Hello? Anybody home? <laughs> okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Oh, hell yeah! Okay, bigger than I'd hoped. I am oh, he I who dwells, dwells. dwells, and you and have you invaded, invaded my dominion. dominion. No one's invading your dominion, okay? I just want to share your powers. Gotta get back in there! I see lots of vests, but no people wearing them. The hell did he do with them? I saw the vests in your basement! What are you doing with the people your angels grabbed? I offer I my invited guests invite salvation, 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 not suffering! Not suffering. I need your powers! You need to leave! Not so easy when you don't have a minion to pick me up and fly me away, huh? Unless, of course, you can make the platforms fall!
What I thought. It's lava. In the penalty box. I'm not leaving until I get what I came for. I grow tired of the company. Flying nursemaids can't protect you forever, pal. You're just delaying the inevitable. You gotta stop doing that. Delson, now! even tickle.
At school, I always tried to blend in. To fade into the background. To disappear. But the bullies found me anyway. They always do. The only place I felt I belonged was in Heaven's Hellfire. In that game, I made the rules. I could summon angels to protect the victims and demons to punish the bullies. But the real world? That... that I couldn't control. At first, I did my best to ignore them. Until that one day, when they pushed me too far. When the DUP came, they said they were taking me to a new school, designed for people like me, different. For six years, she hooked me up to her machines. She made me call them out, always, always stopping before they could save me. Then that crash. That was my chance to, to finally really disappear where no one could find me and hurt me. But when I saw them rounding up more people who were different, I knew what she was gonna do to them, I, I knew. I knew we had to stop her. Delson! Delson? Okay, that's starting to get old. Oh, it sounded like you were in trouble, so I came running. You yeah. okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks, man. I couldn't have done it without you. Oh, wait, I already did. Speaking of, man, you're not gonna believe what I can do now. As soon as I figure out what it is that I can do. Well, the important thing is you got a kidnapper off the streets. Whoa, whoa, bro, not kidnapper. He's more like a rescuer. Delson, listen to me. He took suspected conduits right off the street yeah. against their will. That's kidnapping. Okay, don't go anywhere. First of all, thank you for using the word conduit. Second of all, why are you being such a dick? Look, fine. Let's just agree to disagree. But we both know it's better for everyone if he goes in a cage. Just hang out for a second. Can I talk to you? I thought you were all about rule of law and not locking up people without due process. Hey, normally, that's what I do. Oh, what, so it just gets thrown out the window whenever it's convenient for you, is that it? Just put a red wig and an old trench coat on you, start calling you Augustine. <laughs> no, maybe next Halloween. Cool, so Game Boy and I over there are gonna have a little conversation conduit to conduit. No normals allowed? Fine. If you need me, be right outside, okay? Owen, thank you for all your help. Couldn't have done it without you. Oh, wait, I you already, already did. did. I know, it wasn't funny the first time. <laughs> so, what do you say, Eugene? You, me, a couple of conduits hit the town. You show me some of your new video tricks. I show you how to pick up some girls. Maybe rescue some of our marked brethren. I don't think so. I still feel safer in here. Come on, man. You keep staying down here and playing angels and demons. You're never gonna get laid. Listen, man. It's your life. But there is a way for us to live out there in the real world. But it's up to us to make it happen. You think about that, you let me know, okay?